Hello my people, how are you guys doing? Everything okay? Good to have you guys today on today's show. How is your quarantine going? I hope you guys had a very great Easter in spite of all this whole thing that is going on. One thing we must do, we must not let this COVID-19 or whatever get us down. We must keep doing uh, whatever we see to do. We must keep uh, keeping positive, okay? Don't let anything... Um, weigh you down there's so much to weigh us down out there but you know what what thing you go do you just got to keep on pushing okay um thanks to everybody that always keeps sending their wishes to us it's, it's hard for everybody my brother i don't know about you even if you get everything in the world just to stay just to stay inside from morning to night my goodness it can be very 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 annoying and uh, but we still thank god um special thanks to all our frontline workers um, you know what i discovered i discovered that plenty people for our community for our community all over the place plenty people for our community they do this hospital work some are doctors some are nurses some are um health care help um, what they call them um help give us something like that so many of them some work in the hospital as uh, other uh, support staff okay especially in that uh, uh, intensive care unit the people that move people around take them from stretcher to st some caregivers yes caregivers sorry about that i'm telling you so many of them within the black community so many of them within the african community so many of them within the nigerian community here in canada in us in uk all over the place so please you know that you know that you know somebody who is in the healthcare profession please pray for them try to find out how they are doing a lot of them already contacted this this virus and are dealing with it right now and remember they have families too so if you don't really get uh, an impression if you don't understand the gravity of what is happening just know that you heard this from me that a lot of people in our community are healthcare workers and they need our prayer but um, uh, another serious prayer that we should be offering now is for our brothers and sisters who are in china this china matter is it's not a small to know honestly speaking this china matter it has gone it don't pass don't be silly i'm telling you we were saying okay uh, these people do this one do that we by the way we were able to to discover the 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 man who who you know that um that um official that official who who stood that officer who stood um and uh confronted the chinese government we were able to find out who he is and uh we'll continue to praise him because he did us proud everywhere on the internet people are talking anybody who is concerned about africa they are all talking about him this guy his name is Mr. Dio Lawal, Mr. Dio Lawal, I'm gonna put up his picture so you guys get to see him. Mr. Dio Lawal is the is the official that um, is the official that was there confronting the that that Chinese people. You guys saw the video. We put it up. You can also go to our if you go on our uh, uh, timeline, you know, on our channel you will see a video of this guy um, confronting the Chinese government. He did something that everybody was very proud of. Um, his name is, like I said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this up so you guys see who he is. Yeah, that's him. That's the, that's the guy. His name is Mr. Olu. I'm going to put him up right now so you guys get to see him. You know, so everything we do now live live and direct we don't get time to edit so that's him this is the guy this is the guy that we are all proud of this is the guy that did everybody proud you know see him with his, his family he is the one that said no way we are not see said we are not taking it from you guys okay this is the man and we are all very proud of him very very proud of him uh, let me show you a little bit of of him let's go up and read about him mr dio 
See, Mr. Dayo Lawal serves as the head of Chancery Trade and Investment at the Nigerian Consulate in Guangzhou. This photo was taken on the eve of our departure from China, courtesy of Nigerian basketball. Okay, so this is Joy John standing with the guy. Uh, in person, Mr. Lawal is a man of very few words with a calm disposition. We watched his diplomacy in his finest form play out in a recent viral video when he boldly stood up to the host authorities in China, shielding the Nigerian nationals who were being harassed. It was one of the proudest moments my, of my Nigerian heritage. And with 1963 Vienna Convention of, at his fingertips, Lawal took a firm stance that the Chinese officials reminding with the Chinese officials reminding them that they also had their citizens across Africa and he had been uh, not and there has not been any case of maltreatment towards their citizens especially in Nigeria Africa needs more diplomats like Lawa it's getting too much on this note I say a million bosas for you sir you be the man this is from Joy John okay now uh, we really, really, of course, you guys know we continue to let me pull his picture again so you guys see him. So, this is the man we're talking about. This is the guy, okay? So, we really, really, uh, in worship media, we thank him. We appreciate, we appreciate what he did, okay? Now, but <clears throat> as if the whole thing has, you know, ended, as if the whole thing has stopped. No, it has not. I'm telling you, it has not. But the good thing about it, <laughs> oh my God, this thing never stop. Oh. In fact, it has gotten worse. I'll show you what's going on right now. You will be very, very shocked. Do you know that Chinese people now are, first of all, we're saying that, oh, they're turning away our brothers and sisters from uh, restaurants mcdonald mcdonald which is an american franchise put up a notice banning our people from coming into mcdonald that one i will show you let me say let me say talk i will show you you go see them they told our people that they cannot come into mcdonald you would think that this thing is a joke it's not a joke oh. the thing don't pass that is they don't pass joke matter you will soon hear it. I'll, I'll, I'll play the video for you. Uh, let, let me let me bring it up here. So when it starts playing, you see that? Did you see? Let's go back again. See, we've been informed that from now on, black people are not allowed to enter the restaurant for the sake of your health. Consciously notify the local police for medical isolation. Please understand the inconvenience cost. Police. Can you imagine police in China? Can you imagine? You know, when I say things like this, I wish I was an african leader i wish i was an african leader i will show them a little bit just small not even big i'll show them a little bit of what they are doing because you see these people should be made to understand what they are doing it's because we we leave them you know if we like if we show them what they are doing they will understand i'm telling you they will understand it's because we don't show them anything just allow them to go about and do what they are doing then they think that what they are doing is good but it is not good can you imagine you enter mcdonald with your money to eat and they say no i don't even know what to say and this is a this is a country that has invaded your own country they have businesses everywhere african presidents african leaders give them all the kind of assistance all the kind of leeway that you can't imagine to be doing business in africa look at what they are doing to our people treating them like animals do you know they've been sleeping on the streets on this like they just be moving and they'll be following them behind 
police will just be following them behind to nowhere do you understand it's crazy <laughs> i'm telling you they chase them out of their houses and out of their hotels then the police will stay with them and just follow them around and they can't go into hotels they can't buy food other people will now come and give them food they will eat and these are millionaires i'm not kidding you these are our boys our guys who went to do business in china those guys many of them have millions millions of dollars in chinese account there because they come and enter you, you don't understand the people they are talking about oh. these are not just my my people oh. these people they come there they order four five 40 food containers of a product go and check how much it is and these are the people that the chinese government is treating like this they will lie since that time that we reported this thing they've been lying down on the street they took their passports from them before now they got their passport back nope they just lie down on the road and now it is very cold in china me that lived in canada now for how many years i still can't get used to the cold not to talk of you are in a town can you imagine you need to sleep with heat and now these guys are sleeping outside in the cold uh, and our government has reacted where's a big debris should be when this thing started the big debris said no it's not true it's just that some people had issues with somebody and they just couldn't pay their rent and they keep them out of their house where is she right now you see that's why whenever we rush to to make a statement you begin to wonder what is really the motive is it that you hate the people that are involved you just hate them so you can't even control yourself you just you just blot out this statement that is that is absolutely wrong it is not fair if you don't like people now but at least i'm telling you as if that is not enough i need to show you something <laughs> this one will shock you because you know you go they you go they do somebody something until one day you jam the person that will say hold on no hold on my friend <laughs> what are you talking about hold on so this chinese official they went to somebody's hotel and they told him oh boy we came to pick you up for isolation <laughs> i know before my mouth you go here i need to show you what happened um maybe this one will uh either teach them a lesson or encourage some of our people what they should do when these people come to them i need you to listen and see the the interaction between this man and the chinese official listen <laughs> Why, who isolates who? Who what? Uh, because the coronavirus is very serious. Are you, are you on isolation? Are you isolated? Uh, no. So why should I be, why should you be isolated? Give me one reason, give me one reason. Why should we should be isolated? If we are coming to a to, to quarantine or inside our hotel. Are the, are the Chinese isolated? So, Chinese, one Chinese one are walking about those are Chinese going about their daily activities but because we are Africans these people want to quarantine us why should we be quarantined? and China tell us why we should quarantine China and tell us why we should be quarantined China is outside we should be our, why tell us why we should be quarantined you should tell us why we should quarantine huh? You tell us why we should be quarantined. You come to our hotel. You come to our hotel to quarantine us. Where is Shema? Hmm? This is crazy. This is crazy. This is crazy. So every black person must be quarantined? It's, it's wrong. Huh? So every black person must be quarantined? Two more men. Huh? Two more men. Two white men. We can't go make two times. Those are two. Those are Chinese outside. So every black person must be quarantined? Racist people. We also do okay. We two white men. Come and show us which is. Chencha. Chencha, where you are? So every black person must be quarantined? For what? These guys are crazy. For what? Now, 
Why only one grace must be quarantined? Why, why only one race? This is racism, you know? Is that what the law says? Where is the, where is the text? 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 Where is the law? Are you following the law? So not from Wuhan. I don't even know where how to feel when I watch things like this. I, I I don't I don't know how to feel, but that's just to show you that this thing. They, they say we are doing diplomacy, diplomacy waiting. If we just, sh even if we, we can be polite or oh, we can go and do ballet for them in Nigeria, just like but just marshal them out of the hotel and just tell them that until we know what is happening to our brothers and sisters in China, you people need to stay here for a while. That's what that's the only diplomacy that will work. All these diplomacy say, okay, we are, they are telling you that you people shouldn't be doing this. It's not every uh, 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 waiting. Until they start to kill the people, you don't know these Chinese people what they can do. I'm telling you, it is dangerous what we are playing with. I, it, you see, eh? You don't understand this. You don't understand these people. You think that they are still joking? No, they have already started drawing blood. They have started to draw blood from our people as samples. <laughs> I don't think you people understand what we are talking about. You you, you 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 don't get it. You, you still think this thing is a joke. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you think it's a joke. You still think it's a joke. No, it's not a joke. Oh. <laughs> joke for where? It's not a joke. I'm going to play you this video. Then you see what I'm talking about. It's not a joke. It's not a drawing blood. So as call from a Nigerian in Guangzhou, China, reports that health officials have begun drawing blood samples amongst them. And they begun to as the health officials make their rounds, I am told that decline in testing is not an option. And the random passport search continues. These people leave my house and they're checking my passport, so I don't know. <laughs> See, yeah. Uh, if you're still thinking, if you are still thinking that these people are joking, you are doing that at your own risk. Honestly, if you think that they are joking, you are doing that at your own risk. And the one that is paining me, the one that is just melting my heart, is that even in Africa, we don't suffer this thing as much as Chinese people. Look at the map. Go and look at the map of infections. It's 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 amazing. How we Africans just sit down 
and watch this whole thing being spun around. Haven't you noticed? They are spinning the whole thing around. You know, like when um, somebody is bigger than you, richer than you, and then you do something, they don't turn it around and they blame you. You, that you didn't do anything. They now turn it around and they begin to blame you. Have you ever seen China now says it is black people that are the cause of the problem. You must come, we must take your blood, we must dry you. Can you just, just change the whole story? It's not about black people. In America, say, oh, you know, uh, black people should be very, very careful though, because this thing is now, is black people, black people, black people. Ah, what is going on though? Uh, the time they were talking about where they found the, il the illness. Did you hear one black person mention? Did you hear one black African country mention? Nothing. It was either Chinese lab in Wuhan or the Chinese lab in, uh, in, uh, in America. Some people say it's 5G. Some people say it's uh, Bill Gates. Did you hear one African person mentioned? Did you hear one black American mentioned? Did you hear one black Chinese or black anything for that matter at all? Black people did not, our names didn't, do you see where we are now? They didn't now started killing 5,000, 10,000, 20,000. Initially, it was not killing black people at all. They didn't hear anything about black people. All of a sudden, the whole thing is reversing now. They say it's killing black people more than everybody else. Africa, see 10, 20, 100, 100, 200. Europe, 20,000, 40,000. America, 1 million. Now, where did that one come from? Where, where did China get this thing about these black people that are spreading disease? I don't get it at all. Something is seriously wrong. And <laughs> African leaders, you guys better wake up and do something. If you don't do something, <laughs> oh, there's great danger out there. Very great danger. And uh, <laughs> when it happens, I don't think we will get back from this. It is very, very important that... African leaders take a step and do what they must do. If they don't do it now, they will have a lot to regret. I'm telling you, you have a lot to regret uh, down the road. All right, guys. Um, um, that is really what we're doing. I know a lot of you have been asking me about what's up with Omoyele Shore. And I told you guys that we will do everything that we can to to bring him to come and uh, speak to us on the show. Uh, you guys know um, it, it, there's a lot that uh, we're having to deal with with the Nigerian government. And you also go and check out our video that we did about Omoyele Shore and you will get, um, you get updates on you know what we are talking about uh, what he is up to okay uh today i just wanted to focus again on uh what is going on with our african brothers and sisters in china now if you are in china if you live in china and you have my number please do call me we want an update on what is going on so if you are living this uh, china phobia that is going on right now I know a lot of our people live there in China. Um, I've not gone to the chat room, but if any of you is living there in China, please give me a call. You can call me through WhatsApp. You can call me through uh, direct line. Uh, let me put the number here. It's uh, plus one six four seven nine eight nine two eight three seven. All right. So go ahead, go ahead and call plus one six four seven. 989-647-989-2837. Just give us a quick call. We want to hear from you guys. We want to know what is going on. Okay. Um, uh, somebody says that youth should, uh, should leave the Western world. Leave Western world to go where? Go back to Nigeria. <laughs> Do you see the situation in Nigeria now? So I don't even want to talk about Nigeria. Eh? I have 10, 10 things, 10 things that I learned from Muhammad Buhari's speech. Wonderful speech. 10 good things. I'm going to list. In fact, that was the first time that I saw 
that the president of Nigeria was making sense. Ten, ten solid points that, you know, after listening to his speech, the things that I gained, I'm going to read it for you. Very, the most important thing that I understood that I gained that really, you know, filled my heart and blessed me from uh, General uh, Muhammad Buhari's speech. The number one thing that I learned from his speech after listening to him is that Um, okay, forget about that number one. Now, that number one, just uh, the number two, number two point that he made when he was talking about Nigerian people and how they are suffering. Number two point that he made is that he will, uh, he will. Okay, maybe that number two. Number three, there's no way I can forget number three and number four points. Number five, number six, number seven. Come on, hold on. Maybe <laughs> like say number eight, number nine point, number ten. Come on, which, which in our talk, <laughs> which in our talk seven. Be like, hmm? be like say the man no make any sense so, because. All the things I thought I learned, I can't, I can't remember. <laughs> when I say, when I say, listening to the man, don't, don't they affect my brain? <laughs> so, if the man is giving speech and you love yourself, make you stay away. <laughs> that is the the cocus of the story. <laughs> stay away from the man when he's making his speech. Somebody said, uh, one of my AEC people said that ah, AEC is angry. With Buhari, that he made speech, he didn't talk about the robbery in Ogun State. Another of my good friend, Azaya, said, oh, boss, wait till they talk now. Don't you know that that live speech is a recorded live speech? You know, in Nigeria, we do magic. <laughs> live speech of the president. The president is going to address us 2 p.m. 2 p.m. Eastern Time. That is equivalent to 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 p.m. in Nigeria. But where? By that time, the, 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 they, just do, they just play the video that they recorded. So they don't record the video before the Ogun robbery. The man don't even know what they happen. You are coming to tell the man that. I mean, maybe we just leave the man focus on other things. This guy. You know, just we don't leave everything for God's hands. If you look this coronavirus thing now, you know that God God is just on his throne, just watching us. We 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 say we know. So some people like Buhari and their nonsense crew government. Don't worry. It should be everybody don't they see how where uh, this whole thing don't they go? They don't they see coronavirus and what is capable of happening when God just Come out in hand, just the look on that way. I hope people who are in government in Nigeria who are maltreating us, who are just treating us like we are nothing, even the Chinese people. I hope you guys know that the same God that is just watching us and we can't even do anything about coronavirus, that same God has the power to extinguish you, just switch you off with all your craziness. So, everybody who is oppressed, everybody who. They, they take us do mumu. We could have no worry. This whole thing, small time, you go, you go, you, 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 we could just see the end of this story. I beg. Mm. I need to talk to somebody, Jerry. I want somebody. I have like uh, 10 minutes extra. Somebody call me. Whether you're from China, whether you know come from China, I need to talk. I need somebody to talk. Guys, please give me a call. You know, say this is now COVID 19 period. Show me some love. Call, call, call. Then the. I don't they feel lonely now? Eh? All these things where they, they do us, they annoy me. I gotta talk to somebody. Somebody call, call, call. If I no call, I know you guys don't love me. All these uh, call me, I'll say, love you, love you, love you, love you. Waiting, ah, uh, waiting. Love is a, is a reci, is a reciprocal. You know, something that you are give and give back. So if I'm give love here. I, you know, I, uh, I give love is something. I give you love 
and you are even the ringing the ringing of the phone in my ear is a demonstration of uh, bending yeah so somebody is uh, calling me and then uh, is answering and we are talking then you know you know we are feeling happy eh? ah back somebody is uh, calling me now somebody you're watching and you are calling me and are answering you and they are happy and everybody is okaying mm -hmm. Well, else, uh, if you are also a brother, na bomb na phone, you gotta go just come me way. Can gotta if If you know that you are a brother, not just to be asking me about oh, Shawole or Shawole or Shawole is doing well, but you should just take up, pick up the phone and call before I end this program. I need somebody to talk. Make we just, you know, generally talk because this uh, isolation, no one calls here, remember, you know, the thing is just beginning to, you know, just uh, confine my uh, my uh, mental uh, capacity to be able to you know, figure out this uh, this situation. So, just press the number. It is nothing but a plus one, six, seven, uh, six four seven mm -hmm. nine eight nine mm -hmm. two eight three seven. Mm -hmm. Two eight three seven. Just uh, call me so that uh, Malan way I they call him for me. If you they call him for me, me I they call him for you. Then uh, this uh, COVID, uh, uh, COVID, uh, sorry, COVID uh, one nine way I they talk him for me. I they make me. I they. I they think I'm for I they say the word I they I they I they close, but the the malam I they talk and say the word I they support me I they say malam the word I know they support. Kaganiko the the people of the world is a is a is a thinking that that when the Bible I talk it that when the word is close. The people are just going about the the party. I the miliki. I they do so many things. Kuma, I don't know when the trumpet are sound from heaven. A pool, and then the man as they come down, as they carry my people, I they go back to heaven. But to this man now, Kuma, you they see him say coronavirus. People, I know they party. People, I know they go out for work. Everybody, I they day for house. Everybody at a day for house. So Kagani, I can't talk and say, no, that is a lie. This one, it you know be the time when the world I did stop. Because the the time when the world I did stop, everybody go they do something. Kuma they no go no. Now everybody are ready. Everybody Kuma, I don't pack him back. I say if the world I stop now, me I they go and I they pack everything, Kuma. I they go for heaven with everything where I I they, I they get here. So make I they call him for me. I they wait, make somebody I they call him for me. I they ah uh -huh. somebody I they call him for me. I hope say this person I they call him for me for my program. Uh -huh. My Hello. sister. <laughs> <laughs> I won't talk with Oga now. <laughs> oh yeah, talk, 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 Biko. <laughs> oh, talk to Chief. Oh my God, you got me there, honestly. I was laughing aloud. <laughs> my jaw won't break. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> I was ready to listen to the ten points you made. I mean. Our our only Only for you to just say. Yes, now. Nah. You know, I was. I was so good. I was trying. I, I'm sure he made some serious points, you know, and I was trying to, you know, I, you have to. You remember? Yes, I, I, there, there must be some tempo because how can a president talk and we can't, you know, <laughs> like, I remember when I was in secondary school and they told us. Oh, in the, oh, uh, in year one, they told us to do. You need to turn me down. Turn me down. I'm also. I'm echoing behind you. Turn me down. Okay. There's another device there. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thank you. It's nice speaking. Yeah. <laughs>
No, no, no. I want to. I want to continue talking to you, but the other device oh, okay. that's playing me, I okay. need you to turn it down. Oh, oh all right. Mm. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, I was, this mm -hmm. is a. Uh, let me introduce you first of all. This is a uh, Stella Hill. Stella Hill is um, a very powerful lady here in uh, in Canada. She's a, she's a philanthropist. She's a, a multiculturalist. <laughs> is a community leader and so much. Stella, I really want to thank you for all the things that you do for the community here. All right, I really thank want to appreciate that. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, so coming thank to our you. president. So yeah. We're still echoing. Stella, you need to bring mm -hmm. something down. You need to turn something down. Yes, you I think to, it's about time. You need to you need to turn something down. There's a volume. You need to bring the volume oh. down there. Oh, okay. It's my sorry. I'll turn it down. No. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to do that now. Okay, 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 okay. Is it better now? Yeah, yeah, perfect, perfect. Okay. So, yeah, so you know, yeah. when we were in secondary school, they would ask us uh -huh. to come and do debate. And when we come to do debate, they will now uh -huh. tell the people that don't know what to say. They just said, oh yeah, yeah. oh yeah, just to round up and just go. The best is, uh -huh. because you call, if you don't talk well, the seniors will use Koboko and <laughs> bless you. So, people, oh, oh my God. Hey, yeah, sorry, Stella. The guys that are calling yeah. direct, they are cutting you off. Anyway, the people will come and say, with these few points of mind, I want to tell you uh -huh. that these students are better than brothers when they have not said anything. <laughs> so, <laughs> I remember such things. <laughs> so, I had to pretend that I heard uh -huh. powerful things from the president of yeah. the Federal Republic of Nigeria. <laughs> That was a good one you you did uh, put up there. Honestly, I was just waiting with a pull, a I mean, rapt attention to to hear these ten serious points. Okay. All right, Stella. So Thank you so much for calling in. Okay. Thank you. God bless Thank you. you. Thank you, you, man. God bless you too. All Thank right. you for all the acknowledging the little I'm doing, and uh, I also want to use this opportunity to inform you that. That charity organization will, had, will be turning 10 in July, and we are planning to, or I, we are already start, started the planning to celebrate it in July. Well, so, awesome, awesome. Guess what I'm going to do? I will do an right. interview. I will do you an interview, and then so that we can talk more and let people right. know what you're all about, and then we'll put it up right. on our channel, okay? We'll do like a 30 minutes interview, okay? How about that? All right. All right. That would be great. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so much, Stella. Okay. Thank you Thank very you. much. Yeah. Bless you. Bless I keep you up too. the good job. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. Uh -huh. You see, when people call you like this, when you're talking with people, it's different. It makes sense. Uh, there was somebody was trying to reach me, uh, and uh, I cut them off. Me, I'm going to reach them back because I like it. I like it. This uh, coronavirus thing. We need to talk to each other. You know, when we talk to each other, Wait, who was calling me? Somebody called. I'm going to call them back. Uh -huh. So that I go hear their own point of view. Maybe, maybe, and if to, see, oh, I don't want it to look like if anybody hears something way past the one when I hear from our president when he do this speech, I beg, make una call me, try to show me, you know, waiting, waiting day, because maybe in a me, no understand okay so if you heard more than me from uh, our president you know when they talk mm -hmm. make you make, make you call make we try to understand what's going on okay because I, 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 me the one way i hear when i try to talk him it don't make sense hello oh i'm trying to get through to this guy he called um Oh, okay. I don't know why. He called me when I was talking to Stella. And, um... Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice... No, 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 no. Uh, okay, come on now. I'm giving you one last chance because you called when, um... When we were on with another person. Hello? 
Come, let's talk, let's talk. Where's everybody? Call in, call in, let's 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 gist. I just want general gist. This this coronavirus. Let's just gist about another thing. You wanna tell me what you hear from the president? Tell me what you hear from uh the... Your call has been forwarded to an Okay, okay. This guy, uh we missed him. We missed him completely. Uh we were supposed to have um actually we're supposed to have um um uh, a, a live chat with a special call has been forward we're supposed to have a live chat with a special guest but that didn't work out so we're gonna do that some other time anyways guys i think we had a very very good time on the program today we're gonna come your way tomorrow again and uh continue doing what you're doing oh somebody's calling actually okay okay let's take this guy good job hey olaemi from ireland how are you doing hello hello olaemi how are you from ireland hello mr Ch yeah hello mr chibi how are uh, you doing i'm doing well <laughs> I'm really enjoying your program, sir. You are so fantastic. <laughs> I like your Mickey Mickey something. <laughs> uh, did you did you hear anything from our president that I didn't hear? I beg. <laughs> yes, I did, though, my brother. In fact, now wala Hey, in this lockdown, they won't kill everybody for Nigeria because this is serious. Abi? See, they is this man they extend. They extend fourteen days more. Uh -huh. This is crazy. Of How people go cope? Abi, that, that, that's... How people won't cope? Without I... money, without anything. If you see a lot no, of... No, 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 no. I mean, I don't like what you're saying. Why are you, you're, is, why are you spoiling our bad name? Why are you doing this? <laughs> no, no, it's not a laughing... So no, it's not a laughing matter. How can you say <laughs> that the government of Nigeria did not provide food for its people? Didn't you see when they no, were I... sharing bread? Didn't you see them... Did you see that? It's so yeah. crazy, man. Didn't you see them sharing bread and pure water? How can you say they did not oh, share food? Oh, Jesus. What there is poverty mean? in the land. What do you mean? There is poverty in the they land. They carry bread. They share bread to people. So how can you come <laughs> here on social media and say that my president is not... I don't like it. If this is the kind of thing that you're going to call, then don't call me. What kind of thing is this? No, no. no you're, 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 Excuse me. How can you be like... You want to know? How can you be like... You just, no, no. What are you doing? food is bread not food is bread not food oh my god what do you mean what are you saying what are you not bread? saying they share bread oh one loaf god. of bread and one sachet of pure water can that not hold somebody for at least one week one week what <laughs> you're so funny what? okay 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 talk your own no talk your own talk your own now talk, okay talk. my brother uh -huh. I get get bread. Uh -huh. I get get bread. Yes. With I get get one. I get get bread yes. with one pure water. Yes. Do you think it's okay for for, for one week for for okay. one person? Okay. Can I, own, can I talk my family? own? Can I talk my own yes, now? Sir. I get get bread. Listening. Do you know what is inside? I get get bread. Do you know the ingredient? Yeah. Do you know the multivitamins? Do you know the starch, <laughs> protein, and everything? That is. How can you say that? <laughs> I don't like when people like you come and discredit. Do you know what you're doing? You are actually spoiling our bad name. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. <laughs> this is a big shame to Nigeria, man, Mr. Chibi. Oh my god, I, I can't believe this. This is serious. Uh, my sir. sister, it's, it is it it's is, ridic it is ridiculous. ridiculous. ridiculous I know, I know, I know. I, I, I know, I know. We are just joking, but this is this is nonsense. What can you do? It, what can you do? See, if you take these people serious, I, you can't take them serious. We can't take them serious. I know. So that's I know, why we're laughing. We can't possibly take them serious because the things they do yeah it's 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 amazing you can't even <laughs> you can't believe that somebody can cause did you see them spray in nigeria <laughs> oh my god it's amazing i can when, see that when, and it, when you when they are spraying other places you see the thing coming out like you know like smoke just steam everywhere you know when they want to yeah uh sorry i need to take another color i need to take another color okay Sorry, sorry, I need to take this caller. Hello, how are you? Tell us your name and where you're calling from. Hello, is this Chidi? This is Chidi. How far? I do. How far, Chidi? I do, uh, Indiana. Oh, you do Indiana? 
Yeah. Ah, so you there, America? Yeah, America. Oh, man, oh, what a gonna, you. man. What a gonna, <laughs> how you man? You know, strange, man. <laughs> I be worried, worried, boy, when they America. But make we form first now before we come down. So how are you doing, man? You gonna wanna, man? <laughs> I'm doing good. How about yourself, brother? Yo, man, I'm doing great, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, man. You know, this quarantine, just, this quarantine just driving me crazy, man. You know what I'm just going, man. Man, boy, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're saying, man. I'm about to ask you. Man, we do. Canada. Ah, Canada, we just did inside house, so they just lock us up. No, they want to drive person crazy. <laughs> I did. I, I, you know, eh? Yesterday, I travel, eh? If you see where I travel from my son's room to her room, very terrible journey. I'm telling ah. you. Ah, yeah. Yes, yeah, so. <laughs> yeah, you got your funny out Ah, it was a very awesome trip. How are you yourself now? Just do, don't do both. I just see what's going to happen for Nigeria, man. It's just the shaka my head. That 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 people, eh? That people, that people, eh? Hmm. Hmm. Now I see the robber, like for Lagos. I've been a one million boys that they call them. They just the like a mob, you know. They pack, just the loot stores and all that. Yeah, you know, now what do they talk? Government, you want to lock up place. For this, for here now, when they tell you make you stay inside, they know that your business is going to be affected. Don't you see? They have measures. They are helping people. They are protecting every place. They are locking up the malls. For Nigeria, you just send people home. Nothing. No plan for them. You don't even give them food. Their market, no, nothing. But even the thing is not even working. Like place, during yeah. Easter, during Easter, if you see market, <laughs> if you see market, you know go believe no market. Every Who pe- is so far? <laughs> hey, brother. The people went vote, uh, vote boy, made a, made a go meet the boy, may give them food now. Ah, the level, this level don't pass. This level, I don't even know. This next level, eh? Ah, they 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 here and now. This coronavirus no come call, call dabaru the whole thing, so we don't even know. Oh. It's crazy, it's crazy. We don't even know whether this thing I won't read for Nigeria. This is a coronavirus. Because I know the 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 stuff, I don't understand the reporting and the big deal. Some they say before you know they don't discharge some. Like one of my friends, he say now that they that they that they bribe people to get the to claim say they get the virus. Like one person say that they give out forty thousand, make it for just the isolation. So like saying I met told to extort from the government. Eh, like bros, everything uh, for Nigeria and uh, the more you look the less you see. Uh, <laughs> so at least if if corona if corona if you just suffer corona today, get forty thousand, government get two million, you no, know, discharge you, nothing, nothing. Everybody you know. <laughs> Let me make a leave with you. You are doing a good job. Thank you man. so I'm much. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. God bless you, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, guys. Thank you so much. You're making my day. You know, sometimes, you know, we'll just talk back and forth like uh, like brothers, like sisters. Try to get over this uh, coronavirus thing because if we just follow some of our leaders and the way they handle it. Hey! Yemi, Yemi, uh, you need to talk, turn me down, turn me down, Yemi. Oh, you to, hello, Yemi, I can hear you, but you need to turn me down on your device. Okay, no problem. Uh, are you online, sir? Yes, I am online, Yemi. How are you doing? I'm doing good, sir. I'm calling from New York, sir. Yes, oh my goodness. I, I had you on my mind the other day. How are you doing, my brother? Oh, uh, I'm doing good, sir. Uh, I, you know, sometimes I do feel bad for the people in Nigeria, man. They, they voted, this is what they voted for. You know that's how I'm saying? You know that's how I'm saying? Like, if they can survive, if they can survive rice for four years, they can survive bread and water. <laughs> for, 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 yeah. No, we have to make it. We have to make joke with them. You know, we have to joke with them. You know, because if one of they can survive rice for four years, 
But they can survive but, blood. But maybe I tell you, but see what see what's going on now, my brother. You see the irony of the whole thing. All the rice yeah. and all the materials where the toxic customs seize for Lagos, for Southeast, for where wherever. All of that one they can't carry the whole thing, go they distribute for another part of Nigeria. You see I'm um, yeah, all yeah, these places yeah. where they hear now say they give bread and pure water. Go check all those kind of things. Yeah. Not, before, not before my mouth you go here say uh something something happen, but reading between the lines you go yeah. see what now they talk. So that is still not good. That's still not good. We want we want we want that before. We really want that before. Uh, but not be everybody uh, not be everybody not be everybody we, vote for them, sir. We, we should yes. We should be making fun of everybody now. Like if they can survive the rice the right when when it's election time, if they can survive the rice for, for four years. Mm. They can survive bread too. They can survive bread and water for like for two weeks. <laughs> hmm. You know. I I, I, I don't feel bad for nobody. I don't really feel I don't really feel bad for people like this is really, you know, I don't really feel bad. My brother, you need, you need to feel bad for our people, or you need to feel bad for our people. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I only feel, I only feel, I only feel bad for the innocent one. That's what we're saying. That's what I I'm saying. Bad. You can only because not everybody, not everybody is uh, is part of the problem. Some people, some people don't even yeah. have an idea what the heck is is happening. They don't even know what is going on. They just wake up. And then just go about their duty. Yeah. I mean, they are their little go to find their small uh, uh, gary for that day, chop money for that day. They don't even know what is going on. Listen, I'm going to play a video now. Yeah. I'm going to play a video. This is what is going on in Nigeria. Uh, just just a little bit of the situation. This is in a period when we are talking about um, COVID-19 and talking about. Um, yeah. Um, social distancing. <laughs> oh, make you see social distancing in Nigeria because the government didn't plan things very well. I'm gonna play this tape. <laughs> I just had to play that video so that um, it will give us an idea of what <laughs> what life is in Nigeria. This this is just people struggling for. You see see what it, we already were in dire straits before this COVID nineteen period. Now add COVID nineteen into the equation and you see what our Nigeria looks like. Very very pitiful now you want to tell me that if one person is carrying covid 19 in that place with all that thing that's going on okay i have a caller coming in hey what's up tell us your name and where you're calling from hello my name is uh, oscar i'm calling from california hey oscar how are you my brother 
I'm doing good and you. Oscar, Oscar who? What's your surname? Oscar Anu. Hey! Oscar Anu. Look at this boy, yo. So you're a brother. <laughs> yeah. How far now? I don't know, thank you, man. I don't know, my brother. What's up? What's up? I know, man. Because uh, California, man, we, we read on the news, man. It's crazy, your side. I hope you guys are okay. Yeah, we thank God. We are, we are keeping safe. Yes, yeah, so please, please stay safe. Oh, stay safe. Uh-huh. We are keeping safe by God's grace. We will survive. We have to. We have to survive. We are so scared now. They are saying it's more uh, in the black community, so we don't even understand what all that means. I don't even know. No, my scared. I, 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 I'm so scared this morning because we are looking at things to get better but I don't think it looks like things might get worse you know oh yes oh yes I'm telling you yeah, uh, the way this thing is going it, it has not peaked at all and because so so how is Canada is it much in Canada uh, no it's not much in Canada I must tell you Canada has been relatively okay you know it's been relatively okay it's not that bad of course every Every one person that dies is terrible, you know. So we can't even begin to say yeah. uh, say that if people are dying more, it, uh, it it is better for the place where people are not dying. It's just that the um, the data we're getting from Canada. You, you know, you know, my, my my issue with this whole thing is that you know I've been living, I've lived within China, in a after China for like seven years, mm-hmm. and. Uh, I'm kind of, uh, <clears throat> can't, I kind of can't believe what is going on because if this thing started in China and the way they say it's spreading is the way it's spread, that means if America should record like uh, 100 or 500 or something thousand cases, China mm. should be like recording like uh, one or two million cases at this time, you know? My brother, I don't see, another, but another thing, I don't, you, I don't, one thing you have to know about China, if you have lived in China, <laughs> You know that China will not tell you the truth about this whole thing. Yeah. They will, they will exactly. only tell you what they want you to hear. So if they tell you now that, ah, uh, in China, they are okay, <clears throat> the thing is no longer affecting anybody in China, how are you sure? Do you understand what I'm saying? You don't, you're yeah, not sure. Yeah. You're not sure that it's affecting any, that it's, uh, th- that what they are telling you is the truth. So that's why you can't trust anything that that china is even telling you <laughs> you can't trust what they will tell you only what they want you to hear this is crazy they, that's china my, 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 my major fear now is that the way this thing has hit america and europe mm. if it hit nigeria with the kind of corruption we have do you think anybody hey. is going to survive hey my brother you know we've been shouting nigeria's own sins uh, we don't nigeria's case is what will I? I can't even. I don't know what to say. It's only God. We'll just be praying that um, if the thing hits Nigeria, that uh, uh, hits Nigeria, the way, hmm. and you know they, they 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 are taking the case of Ebola, but they, this one is quite different from Ebola, you know. Uh, do you, you see? Do you see the video that I posted? You see, the, you see that video. This is inside this. I've not COVID- yet. To, I have not yet to watch it. Okay. Uh, okay while we are talking, to- while we are talking, I posted a video. It shows. Uh, people going to collect food and they were mm-hmm. the food is in the bus eh? is like you see when you drop a piece of food inside where ants are you see the way they just attack you know those red ants right now yeah. the way they they devour the thing that's what yeah. you will see in that video and these people yeah. they are not running away from each other everybody's struggling for the thing and <laughs> If, yeah, if, if, if one of them has uh, COVID-19, that means the rest of the people will be in trouble. And, and, and even since yesterday, or since this weekend, this last weekend, mm. people, there has there been a, day, a daylight robbery in Lagos. Uh-uh, know? it's happening all over the place. All over the place. <laughs> and uh, and uh, this, this stupid man is extending the, 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 the lockdown without any provision to that's, check. That's that's the thing. That's the thing. Lo- extending it. 
it's okay for me but before you extend it give the people what they will use to be doing the extension now there's nothing there's nothing, nothing. Hey, brother, let me let me take a call from one of our callers, okay? Okay. Thank you so much right. for calling. Thank you. God bless you. You're welcome. Yeah. Okay, um we had a caller coming in and uh we missed him, so if you were calling in please just call once and then we will round up but you know i don't know about you but um it feels good to talk to some of our people and know how we're doing because this whole thing can in fact i should do more of these callings you know we should just have a day you know just come calling and uh you guys do the talking i listen i talk back to you and let's discuss because we have all the time in the world we're at home right okay so it's good when we just call each other and talk eh? all these people that are uh, biafla it's only biafla people eh? it's only do the war republic only do the war republic now you want eh, blows it's only house house eh, arewa republic mm -hmm. nah man Right now, mm, this coronavirus that is the issue. <laughs> we are all fighting for Biafra. We are fighting for Dudua Republic. We are fighting for Arewa Republic. All of that. But just right now, the main, the main thing is this coronavirus. So, Koro is the main, the main topic. So, make, uh, um, make anybody way they talk about all these things make we they think about our people right now make we they think about how to take care of our people if you get small money make you send go your village or me i don't send go my village tire we get all these uh, small small village groups town town union group um everything if they contribute money they send back to our people I beg try send money back to your people if you were on a few minutes ago you'll see that boss that boss that's one boss now waiting they take bring food to share people <laughs> uh, you saw what they did to that food in the day of social distancing hmm. if one person there carry that coronavirus hmm, your guess is as good as mine what to become of those people anyway is anybody watching us from china can you use uh, use a call card just use call card and give us a call it'd be nice to hear from any of our guys in china i know that some of you are in china now come on come on guys um where where are you where are you where are you some of our people in china um call call let's hear what's happening from guangzhou Guangzhou, I love Guangzhou. Guangzhou, if you enter Guangzhou, you can just start to speak any language. If you're a Yoruba person, just start to blow Yoruba. If you're a thief man, talk thief there in Guangzhou. You see a thief man there in uh, in Guangzhou. I, it will shock you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. If you, but a lot of now, bros, my people, they there. Well, well. If you enter restaurants, make you just order for Gary. The Chinese man will come there and answer you. Say, what do you want? You want? Uh, do you want gari or apple or rice and beans and stew? <laughs> You'll be shocked. Is that in China? Yes. So in China, uh, this 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 these people just messing up our people there in 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 in, uh, in China. Hmm? I'm looking for some man. man. Uh, I want to play something for you guys while we're waiting for someone to to do this thing. Um, I never even see our market. You know, some of you, when we're talking about Guangzhou, you don't know how our people are in uh, in, in in Guangzhou. But maybe when we show you the picture. You go understand what with the talk. Hmm? I'm just going to go and show you guys a picture of our people there in Guangzhou. This 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 picture I'm going to show you now. This is not on the market too. 
No, <laughs> this is not on the chair market. This is not a Laba International Market. Too. This market I'm going to show you now is right in the heart of China. One quem. No be say then say make them no tell them not say then talk say then talk. This is right in the heart of China. One quem and you go surprise. You go surprise. Make I just play them. Hmm. Mm -hmm. think you see um, you see you see how our people relate with these Chinese people our people are there with full ground because carry us the mess up anyway I had to go back to that video to remind you guys to pray for our brothers and sisters there in China who are facing terrible oppression now they've been taken uh, into isolation after 14 days they still keep them in isolation again sending them back to isolation drawing their blood who knows whether they are pushing something into the blood as they are drawing the blood anyway um from all of us here and uh toronto canada uh worship media team this is me saying we love you okay take care of yourselves i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow okay come back come back and we'll do it again okay bye bye